up guys? Mike with Infinity Personal Training and the Posture Police are back for you. We are coming for you guys, sitting at your computer all day, on your phone texting all day. You're slouched, your shoulders are cranky, they're mad at you and you can't perform, you can't keep crushing it. So we're here to fix that. We're gonna give you a little mobility snack uh, that you can do as many times as you want during the day. It's real simple. You can sit at your desk, you don't have to get up, you don't need any fancy equipment. I have my makeshift desk right here. I'm going to slide in here. So on this one, we're gonna start out real nice and tall, that good posture you want. We're gonna pull those shoulders back, nice and tall, real proud chest. We're gonna reach out with those hands. So my fingertips are out here, so I'm nice and reached out. Shoulders back and down, real proud chest, okay? Then from here, I'm just going to kind of flex into it. So my upper back is kind of rounding, and I'm gonna pull back and down again. So the whole time I'm pushing those hands into my desk, and we're just gonna go kind of back and forth with some good breathing. So Breathing in, and then exhaling as we kind of come up into it. Then from here, I'm gonna go into that real proud chest, nice and tall, and I'm going to shift over to the right, and I'm gonna draw a nice circle to get back to my left. So I'm gonna kind of go into that rounded or stretched position, work into my left. I'm keeping my elbows locked. What you don't wanna do here is kind of cheat and kind of just shift over. We wanna go nice and slow, reaching out, pushing down with our hands, stretch and then real proud kind of back to the middle once I get back there I'm gonna work back and around back to the middle there okay and so we can kind of work to our right work to our left forward backwards I recommend kind of doing five starting out just kind of forward backwards and then five each way rounding but like I said you can do this as many times as you'd like uh, get those shoulders pulled back get the shoulder blades kind of moving along that rib cage get you feeling good okay guys so we'll see you again with the posture police another time and then we'll see you again on another technique tuesday you just got teed up see you soon guys wee -oo, wee -oo, wee -oo, wee -oo. hey guys what's going on mike with the Finney personal training and the posture police are back and coming for you okay so we've been spending a lot of time sitting at our computer sitting at the table hunching the back getting those shoulders shrugged up into our ears and we are here today to get those shoulders and necks loosened up, okay? So first thing we got, we're gonna stand up, take three to five minutes out of your day, knock these out, and we're gonna start out with our hands out nice and wide here, okay? So palm, uh, palms facing away from me, shoulders are back and down, and then we're just going to slowly shrug up, taking a big deep breath in, okay? Then from here, I'm going to pull those shoulders down, actively breathing out, pulling my ribs down as well, and really feeling those upper traps relax in there, okay? And then from the side, we can kind of get a little bit of that external rotation, turning our palms out as we pull down, all right? So you're gonna knock out three to five of those pull downs. Next one we got, so you're gonna take one hand, and you're gonna put it back behind your head, so right in here, and then the other one, I'm pushing that down, okay? So we're still getting some stretch in that trap there. Then I'm actively going to push that elbow back. So right in here, squeezing that here. Then I'm going to go into a twist. I'm gonna turn away from that elbow and I'm the whole time I'm pulling, 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 pulling until I can't twist anymore. Then I'm going to bring this elbow across my body and then reset, okay? So here, boom, twist, 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 twist and then come across the body, okay? Same thing there, three to five reps on each side with that. All right, then our last one, we're gonna start at 90 degrees, kind of with those elbows right out in front of us here. I'll show you from the side, so right in here. And then we're going to reach up or drive those elbows up to the ceiling, right in here. And then from here, I'm gonna put my hands kind of in the back of my head, push the elbows back, and I'm actively going to pull down or push those shoulders down, okay? Then shake it out, bring it right back to that 90 degrees. Drive, 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 drive till we can't go anymore. Then hands behind the head, elbows go out wide and pulling down there, okay? So knock that one out, three to five reps as well. Focus on good, long, big, deep breaths, okay? This is also a great stress reliever, gets you away from work for a little bit and kind of reset um, your breath, okay? So try those out, and the Posture Police will see you again on another Technique Tuesday. You just got teed up. Take care, guys.
in addition to the exercises that Mike did for your upper body, I want to go through some for your lower body. So stand behind your chair and you're going to do calf raises. So you're just going to go on your tippy toes and then come back down. You can do about 20 of those and do about three sets. And then you sit in your chair and you can do figure four. So you take one ankle, put it on your knee and you could either, sometimes this is enough depending on your the tightness of your hips and you can push down not nothing so that it hurts just like slightly and then kind of come up push it down and then if you need more you can lean over with the flat back and of course you would do the other side another thing you can do is you're going to do a spinal twist so you can cross your legs wait which way sorry so <laughs> cross your let's say you have your left leg crossed over your right you're going to go to the left so you could twist again go to your mobility so if this is what you need and that's where you're at you go there, just make sure your shoulders are back, um, posture is really straight. And then if you need more, you can continue going back. And again, we would do the other side. And then last one, if you're sitting here at your desk, you can grab your arms and kind of open up your chest here. Again, think shoulders back, chest really uh, out and back really flat. And then lift up and kind of come up from there. That's it. All right, last thing I want to talk about the position of your computer. So I'm showing you my setup right now. I have an external monitor that I have lifted up or it's big enough so that I'm looking straight on and I'm not having to look down. I also have my laptop on a stand. So when I do look at this one, it's eye level again, so I'm not looking down. And then my mouse pad, I don't have one with the bump because when you do that, it puts your hand at an unnatural position and you're like, it basically makes things worse for you. So you definitely want, if you don't have a stand or you can't get access to a stand, grab books, grab a box, grab something so that your computer is eye level. And that's it.